You're listening to Soap Dirt, the latest in television entertainment news. Hey there, Bold and the Beautiful fans. It is Soap Dirt on YouTube, and we have got your early edition spoilers for the week of June 26th through 30th. There's a tiny little sliver of Rome left in what's coming up, but everything else is fallout from all the juicy stuff happening this week, the week of June 19th through the 23rd in Rome. So we've got four big spoilers for you all about front burner, hot romantic storylines on BNB. We want to share those with you right now. If you haven't already though, take a moment please and reach down and click that subscribe button so you don't miss any of our bold and beautiful spoilers, casting news predictions, everything you need to know. Okay. So (laughs) this spoiler is very funny to me because it echoes the what happens in Vegas stays in Vegas motto. And it's what happens in Rome doesn't always stay in Rome. This could be about Broken Ridge or this could be about Thomas and Hope because on Friday the 23rd, That's when Liam sees Hope grab Thomas and kiss him and, you know, his eyes explode, his ego explodes. How many people listening really feel bad for Liam? I mean, come on. He's cheated on her. He's cheated on Steffi. He just bounces back and forth. He's the human ping pong ball. So I don't feel too bad for him. And what I think this, what happens in Rome doesn't always stay in Rome can mean one of two things. It could mean people talking about what happened in Rome and spreading word about what happens in Rome, or it could mean the fallout happens afterwards. So when it comes to Hope and Thomas, I, it is, it is Liam nature to not confront, to not immediately confront, to run away, to run to Steffi usually, sometimes to run away to Steffi and fall in her bed. And we've already seen behind the scene photos of a very upset Liam talking to Steffi. So will he stay and confront this situation with hope or will he whine to Steffi, hopefully not get in Steffi's bed and then run back to LA to lick his wounds and his ego and try to figure things out? I think it's going to be the run. I think it's going to be flight over fight. And it should be interesting. So the what happens in Rome doesn't always stay in Rome if we're talking about with Brooke and Ridge. And I honestly think this spoiler is meant to apply to both couples, not one versus the other. With Brooke and Ridge, she has gotten him to change his mind about destiny, which is exciting because now we can hear the word destiny another 5,000 times next week. Okay. <laughs> I don't ever want to hear that word again. All right. So they're going to come back and Brooke is going to tell everybody how she and Ridge are back together. She's not going to hold back. She is going to be gushing about it where everybody can hear and specifically and hopefully where she knows Taylor can hear about it. You know, she is going to be so excited to let Taylor know that she and Ridge are back on. Come on. If you were in a rivalry like that, wouldn't you do the same thing? Just rub it in the other woman's face. All right. Um, on also on the week of June 26, specifically on Monday, June 26, we have got the powerhouse performance of Andrea Bocelli, the famed blind tenor, who's an amazing singer. And we're also going to see his wife, Veronica Bocelli and his daughter, their daughter, Virginia Bocelli on. The premise is that Andrea Bocelli's wife is a friend of Brooke's and Brooke gets him to perform a love song for her and Ridge because he's Ridge's favorite singer. And what's interesting, I think I've mentioned this in a different, in the maybe a comings and goings video, is that one outlet said that they filmed that performance on a soundstage in LA, and then another said they filmed it there in Rome. Looking at the scene, having seen some of the video of it, it definitely looks like it's on a soundstage. Whether it's a soundstage in Italy or back in LA, who knows? I mean, Andrea Bocelli tours, he's world famous. So it wouldn't be out of the realm of possibility that he was in LA and able to shoot at the CBS lot. All right, another spoiler. And again, this one is, again, feels like it applies to both Thomas and Liam and also to Brooke and Taylor. It feels like multi-use spoilers they've given us. The spoiler is that one person's one person gets their fairy tale ending, but it is another person's nightmare. So for Brooke, 
if it's her fairy tale ending to wind up with Ridge and achieve their destiny, that means it would definitely be Taylor Hayes' nightmare because she wants Ridge and she doesn't want Brooke to have her. As for this applying to Thomas and Liam, if Thomas's fairy tale ending is to be with Hope, then that would definitely be Liam's nightmare. However, I think that probably we're just going to get that kiss in Rome. I don't think Hope and Thomas are going to hit the sheets. I really don't. Bald just isn't that dramatic for a soap opera. And then they're coming back on, I think, Monday. So we'll have to wait and see, but... I think this happy ending fairy tale thing is more about Brooke and Taylor. Because when you think about a fairy tale ending, you think about generally that's what a woman is looking for, not a guy. So I tend to think it's Brooke's fairy tale ending, Taylor's nightmare. Before we share with you our last hot spoiler for the week of June 26, please reach down, click that subscribe button so you don't miss any of our bold and the beautiful spoilers and updates right here on Soap Dirt at YouTube. All right, the last spoiler is again about Liam, and it's pieces of the puzzle begin to fall into place for Liam. So I think this is this spoiler in particular is another reason that I think he is going to run back to LA with his tail tucked between his legs to think. And I think we're going to get a ton of flashbacks of when he has talked to her, talked to his wife about Thomas and Hope has looked a certain way about it. Or she said a certain thing, like when she told him the other day that she wasn't going going to ask Ridge if Thomas could stay apart from the trip because she said she didn't want to. He's going to start thinking about every single behavior that Hope has exhibited recently and how it could reflect her crush on Thomas. I'm really interested to see if the writers have done it to where it dawns on Liam that Hope might have been thinking about him while they were getting busy on the sofa because she was having a full-on Thomas fantasy when Liam was doing her on the sofa a couple of times and then you know she was having those really active fantasies at work on the plane she's just out of control so I am curious to see how much Liam figures out. Let us know what you think in the comments below about what you want to see as the fallout from Liam seeing Hope with Thomas in Italy as we head into the week of June 26th on b b Thank you for being a loyal listener. Follow us wherever you get your podcast because you don't want to miss the next episode. Soap Dirt is on all the major podcast platforms, including Apple Podcasts, Spotify, iHeartRadio, and more.